protect your home with garlic in the holy month. This is holy month and I have come here to remind you that the holy month is upon us and you cannot but protect your home during this period. During this period, there's always a lot of negative things that are happening. During these times, there's always a lot of witchcraft. There's always a lot of evils that people do. And you cannot but send those evil arms back to the enemies and protect yourself during this week. What is the holy week for those who don't know? This is the week that precedes the Easter. Okay? When Jesus entered Jerusalem and when he had the Last Supper and when he was crucified and when he was resurrected. So this is a very holy, uh, this is a very powerful time of the year that you cannot but protect your life. And I've come here. It is simple but powerful spiritual exercise that you can do right now. Okay? I mean, you have to do this during that week. It's very important. When is this week? Starting March 24, okay, until March 31st. So you want to make sure that you do it during that week. So now, what is this powerful spiritual exercise? How is it going to work? It's going to work to destroy every form of witchcraft okay or any evil that the people of the underworld may send to you during this period okay to return all evil back to the sender it will protect your home and you will experience peace and and progress in your life afterward money will come in everything that you wanted will come in so you want to tap into the power in this week to make sure things work for you. My name is Precious and this is Precious Spiritual TV. On this channel, we pray. We seek the face of God Almighty. We do spiritual exercises and God Almighty has been very faithful. If you love what we do on this channel, you want to make sure you join us here and subscribe to this channel and be very active and do the spiritual exercises and God Almighty will definitely change your life for good in the mighty name of God. Amen. So if you're here with me watching, I welcome you to, to this beautiful space. Remember to put your name in the comment section and God Almighty will bless you. All right. Now, garlic is the main item that we're using. It's very, very powerful. It's divine. It's used in many spiritual exercises. It's used in many religious and traditional practices for thousands of years. And it works perfectly in the spiritual realm to send evil back to the enemy, to protect you, to protect your life, to protect everything that you have. So you cannot but get this garlic. Please, if you don't have it, make sure you get it. We still have a few days, like how many days? Two days before we get to March 24. Make sure you get garlic. Where can you get garlic? Get it from where they sell organic items, where they sell spiritual items, right? It's from where they sell spices. You can get these items there so this is it for many of you that don't know okay it's very very powerful so you want to make sure you get it so you only need four pieces just four one two three four just four pieces of garlic okay just four pieces four that's all you need so now once you get that garlic you want to make sure that you are going to turn it into what i call a cross you form something like a cross, right? Let me show you what I mean by that. So you're going to make sure you grab something like a sharp object. It can be a toothpick. It may be, uh, it may be a needle. Any of these things that can hold the garlic together. So you're going to form this garlic into a cross. So this is a toothpick that you're going to use. You form it into a cross, okay? Like this. So that's one side. You're going to do another side too. All right. So it's going to form like a cross in such a way that it's going to be like this. Okay. So that's what it's going to form eventually when you do this. So you have to get something like a, maybe it could be a string. It could be a rubber band like this to hold this together. 
okay so go right ahead and start doing this just to hold these things together to form a cross so once it forms a cross now comes the most important part things that you have to do you have to make sure that you take this in your hand okay look at look at what it forms eventually that's what it's going to form so you're not going to take this cross you will take it in your hand you're going to make sure you put it in your hands like this and you're going to say these powerful prayers you will say your name seven times okay make sure you include the name of your household members your children your parents your family members everybody that is related to you because every one of these people okay as long as they're living in your household even if they are not there they all need protection we all need protection and in this new week you want to make sure this holy week you want to make sure that your household is protected your home is protected no witchcraft comes to you you're making sure that you send all evil back to the enemy so you now hold it in your hand and you say it into in your prayer you will say by the power in this holy week by the power in this holy week i'm tapping into the power of this garlic here and the power of this holy week i am using this to protect my home to protect my to protect my energies to protect everything that i have in the mighty name of jesus by the name of the father by the name of the son and by the name of the holy spirit i protect my home i protect my doorsteps every part of my home in the mighty name of god i protect everything against witchcraft against low energy against bad luck against lack of progress in the mighty name of jesus amen any evil harm that may want to come around during this holy week i send all evil back to the enemies now in the mighty name of jesus amen and i ask the angels to protect our home and i pray that divine energy divine prosperity divine love reign supreme in our home in the mighty name of jesus amen and that by the power in this special name of jesus i protect our home from all evil harms so now please as you send that prayer you are going to make sure you read these protection psalms which is from the bible remember you have to make sure you align with the spirit of this week you have to make sure you are in high spirit you have to make sure you are filled with power during this spirit during this period so read these powerful psalms from the bible which is psalm 35 you want to read psalm 91 psalm 109 please read them powerfully you're going to read them one after the other every day throughout this week the first day the second day the third day the fourth day the fifth day the sixth day the seventh day you want to make sure you do all of that and say all your prayers anything that you wanted during this week you want to do it remember this is the week it's very very powerful this week is leading up to easter and this is reminding of us of when jesus entered the jerusalem and when he was i mean he had the first supper the last supper and when he was persecuted he was crucified and when he was resurrected it's a very very powerful week so you want to make sure you do that so now after you've done that after the uh the seven days so which is uh april 1st remember holy week is going to be march 24 up until march 31st so that ends the month so now april 1st which is the which is uh the ninth and uh, the eighth day you're not going to take these items here this cross okay now this cross after praying with it you want to make sure that you leave it on your door it has to be on your door it's very important so it has to be on your door you just hang it just hang it with something you can hang it like this on your door so entrance door i'm talking about entrance door don't hang it on any other door it will be on your entrance door you will leave it there 
So the time you want to pray for each day, you only take it and put it in your hand and pray over it. So once you've done with the prayer, you will leave this garlic back on the on the on the door. You get what I'm saying? Please do that. So now, which when it is the eighth day, which is the la uh, the April first, you now take this cross, assist like this, you will return it back to hearth. You will return it back to hearth. It's very important. Don't just dump it in the trash. No, don't flush it down the toilet. Just return it back to earth okay if you can if you don't have anywhere to dig you can simply just throw it in the flowing water all right it's very important throw it in the flowing water but don't throw it in the trash don't throw it in the toilet this has a reason because it's only you get what i'm saying you only have to put it dig it and bury it if it grows fine if it doesn't fine but make sure you return it back to earth and what will happen will shock you. You will be protected. Everything that you have will be protected. No evil harm will come to you. You will try to see that, okay, your sanctuary, which is your home, which is your temple, will be filled with happiness, with joy, with prosperity, with money, with everything at all that will be praying to God Almighty for during this period. Please everybody should do this everybody must watch this you get what i'm saying so and after it you will thank yourself for doing this in the mighty name of jesus please pray from your heart pour all your emotions into it say that may the love of christ maybe the power of christ okay illuminate every corner of my home every room so you have to make sure you mention everything in your home your rooms, your bedrooms, every room, every corner should be filled with the power of God Almighty. That every evil, every negative energy, every bad aura that is in your home, that is chasing away money, okay, that is harboring demons, evil spirits in your home should be destroyed by the power of the Christ in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. That I invoke divine protection over this home. In the mighty name of Jesus, I invoke divine power into this home. In the mighty name of Jesus, amen, amen, amen. Please say that prayer for as long as you can, okay? Prayer can never be too much, right? So please go right ahead and make sure that you never forget. Make sure you remember, set a reminder so that you can always do it on that day, which is March 24. 2024 and up until march 31st 2024 so when this is the uh, april 1st we are going to return this back to earth in the mighty name of jesus and i'm praying for you today for as many of you that are watching this video that are planning to do this i pray that may the holy week invite divine change divine shift in your life in the mighty name of jesus I pray that there's a divine shift in your financial life. I pray that there's a divine shift in your job situation, in your life, in your family, in your marriage, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. May this new week invoke divine protection over your home in the mighty name of Jesus. May this new week make love, peace, and prosperity and harmony reign supreme in your home in the mighty name of Jesus. May every corner of your home every corner of your office space the business place may he be filled with protection with money with love in the mighty name of jesus amen 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 thank you so much all of you for watching i want to appreciate it i believe that you learn a new way to spend your new holy week okay as we approach easter i pray that god almighty will give you all the divine miracles the blessings the favor everything that you've been seeking is faithful in the mighty name of jesus amen 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 thank you god bless you all if you have any prayer requests you want me to pray for you over anything you want to make sure you use this opportunity put them down in the comment section and after this video i will definitely pray for you and i believe that god almighty will answer your prayers in the mighty name of jesus Amen, amen, amen. What do you think about this video? Does it make any sense to you? Is it very helpful? If it is helpful, 
please put it in that in the comment section. And if you believe that God Almighty will use this Holy Week, this powerful spiritual exercise to change every area of your life around, just type in the comment section, say, I believe and I agree that this will work for me in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen, amen, amen. So put the prayer request in the comment section if you have any. If you want me to pray for any members of your family, please put their names there and put the prayer request. I would definitely pray for you. I pray for every single member of this channel. Okay, as long as you're a member of this channel, I pray for every single one. And I pray that God Almighty will answer those prayers in the mighty name of God. Amen, amen, amen. So if you want me to pray for you over a particular spiritual issue that you're going through, you want to make sure you leave it there. So be specific and I will definitely pray for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 God bless you all. God bless you all. If you're new here, I welcome you to this beautiful space. Remember to subscribe to this channel. Make sure you press the notification button and ring the bell so that you can always get my video every single time. So God bless you all for, for joining. God bless you all. And for you, my longtime supporters, thank you so much for always watching my video, for coming time and time again to watch my videos. God bless you all. I'll see you in my next video. Until then, stay safe and be blessed. I love you all. Bye.